All right, guys, I'm leaving my house right now. Got my cat up here. Um, as you can see, it's already coming down pretty solidly. It's been raining all morning. <coughs> Time to head to my mom's, as I said in my past video. She needs me to take care of her chicken, take care of her cat, and just make sure that the whole place doesn't flood, that her Prius doesn't catch fire with too much flooding. So, that's what we're doing, and I'm obviously bringing my cat because I'm not leaving her behind at my place alone. Who knows what will happen. There's trees everywhere around here, and yeah. Luna, are you ready? Luna! She said meow. My mom lives um, right by Indian Rocks Beach. She's about a 10 minute walk from the beach. And so obviously I'm hoping that, you know, Luna, it's okay, baby. It's okay, girl. So I'm hoping that the hurricane moves, you know, south, more south, more south, more south and away from us. But if not, we'll see what happens. And this is my first hurricane, that's all I can say. So this is my mom's home. Uh, we do have a kayak. I don't know if that'll help, but this is what we're looking at right now. This is my car. This is where she lives. This is her home. Entrance. So this is the backyard area. This is where the chicken are in the back over there to the right behind the house. So we're hoping all this stays intact. We're hoping the chickens are all right back there. And uh, if something goes wrong, I'm gonna have to basically come out here and help out the chicken, you know, try and round them up, maybe get them inside. I'm not sure how bad it is yet. As you can see, it is like a mobile home sort of build. I'm not sure if it'll hold up against this storm, but all we can do is wait and see. So I'm in my mom's room. Pretty unorganized, as you can tell. My mom doesn't really care about where she sleeps and whatnot, but this is Lily. She has no idea what's happening tonight. She's just a little sweetheart who wants some love. Right, baby? These are my mom's chiclets. Um, if things go bad in here, I need to take them out and try and put them somewhere safe. But yeah, as you can see, very, I hope this thing doesn't come down. This is where she said, you know, is the safest spot. You got wood panels up here. These wooden panels are supposed to be really strongly supported. You know, that's, yeah, that's. And over here, if you can see this black tube running across all the way to the chicken coop and beyond to, to the outside of the home. That's the most important thing. If it if I don't make sure it is circulating, that's where the flooding will happen. And uh, that's when I'll have to go outside and basically start undigging it and unclogging it because if that thing gets clogged up, there will be water everywhere in this home. So it is currently 2.44 Wednesday. Hurricane's supposed to hit between 8, 10, 12, 2 a.m. And just to show you where I am, so as you can see, this is where we are, Sarasota, Bradenton, St. Pete. She is basically right on the ocean, as you can see. We're about a 10 minute walk away from Indian Rocks Beach. Update, it is 4.44 p.m. Rain is starting to come down a bit harder. Let's see what we got. This little girl right here has no idea what is headed our way tonight. She's still so playful and following me everywhere and jumping and stuff. I just got this notification on my phone. It's a warning. Pinellas County shelter in place now. Wind gusts at over 50 miles per hour. First responders now off the road. Settle into a safe place and stay put until a threat has passed and it's safe to go outside. It is 6.30. Um, still just hanging out. Obviously bored. Um, let's take a look at the wind gusts. Oh god, it's getting in here already. Well, <clears throat> I don't know what it's gonna look like after Hurricane Milton has 
done its damage, but all I can do is continue to wait and see. So we just got another warning, as you can see. That's my mom, by the way, in the picture with me. Um, National Weather Service, an extreme wind warning is in effect for this area for the immediate danger of life-threatening winds until 9.30 p.m. It is now 6.30. That's about three hours of whatever the hell will happen here. Take cover now in an interior room of a sturdy building. I don't think my mom's mobile home is too sturdy, but let's take a look outside again. I'm trying to make the most out of my time um, waiting for this hurricane to pass. So as you can see, I'm just editing another video. Um, yeah, just editing. Might as well be productive while I'm waiting here doing nothing. My brother just got here, um, guy's dog, because who knows what can happen, so he came here to ride it out with me. You can't jump over the things, dumbass. Smooth move, that was really smooth. I didn't even do it, really You're really stupid. You should've went with one fine, of these. Six, baby! I think we're the last house in this neighborhood that still has power. What time is it? I don't even know, but... Oh, you shouldn't have said that. Now we're done. Oh shit. I literally saw it fucking spark up. Fuck. Damn it. That was our transformer. Out of power, guys. Damn. Let's see what it's looking like out here. All right, guys. It is about 12 o'clock at night. Um, we are officially out of power. Um, for the night, it's not turning on anymore. But besides like some wind and some whistling outside and a little bit of a little bit of movement, but nothing crazy. So yeah, it's, I'm about to go to sleep. Really lucky that it didn't directly hit us. Very, very fortunate. And see you guys tomorrow morning. Alright guys. It's 8 a.m. in the morning. Um let's see what damage we got. Flower pot is pushed over, pretty damaging. <sighs> well, um, good news is this is still standing. So this fence is still standing all around, so not a lot of structural damage at all. Just a little bit of this little fence and knickknacks, but nothing crazy at all, guys. Nothing crazy at all. Got out of gin, fucker. It's goddamn zoo in here, I tell you that. Hi Luna! We should not be driving because there's like power lines down and such and whatnot, but I'm not staying here at my mom's. I'm gonna go drive home and see what kind of damage we have and hopefully I can make it there. Alright guys, I'm pulling into my home. Let's see what we got here. 